Assalamualaikum everyone. I am back with another video and uh, today I will be showing you uh, that how to remove this uh, hamburger export as a PDF or Excel and CSV uh, thing because uh, uh, in my next video in my upcoming video i'll be creating one uh, button through which we can download all the data which is already present in uh, over here so uh, f f uh, before uh, releasing that video i'll be showing you this how to remove this uh, hamburger thing so for this we have uh, we need to open this incident data table from url definition which is uh, if you see this is the uh, widget which is present url definition so over here you will not get uh, uh, which is present here we need to find the data table of this particular incident uh, 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 data table from uh, url definition inside this we will have that uh, data table uh, incident data table which I have already created and I have shown you how uh, this data table has been created in my previous videos if you don't know then go back and uh, watch my videos on this so uh, for you guys I have opened this data table so I will open it in the widget editor it takes time to open so um, basically uh, if you see in the client script uh, if you search with the control F export because these are the export type if you search then over here you will find the scope dot export type PDF is there uh, same excel and CSV is there which was present over there but how all these things is happening so it is coming from the html part if you see here export is there and if i remove this li part then the whole thing will be will not be visible okay so uh, before uh, instead of uh, commenting this part we need to comment this that will be better uh, so i'll just comment this part this whole li part and i'll save it if i just refresh this page and if i just click here nothing is coming it's just a white thing is coming and it should not come okay so the mistake which i have done is i have commented this li part instead of ul part so i'll just comment this out lie till here and if I save if I just refresh And if I click, uh, no, nothing is happening now. So uh, it will not work because I have already commented that part. So uh, now in my next video, uh, you will be watching how I will create one button, dynamic button, uh, on clicking of which you will be able to download all the uh, f all the uh, things. If you add the filter as well, everything will work like whatever if according to that particular filter, the number of records will also get downloaded and you can export in uh, CSV. Basically, I'll be showing you that. So keep watching, keep liking my videos, keep subscribing. Uh, thank you all. Thanks for watching.